This is shuttle launch control at T minus three hours and holding with about one hour, 22 minutes and 50 seconds remaining in our hold today. Space Shuttle Discovery, the venerable veteran of America's human spaceflight fleet proudly resting atop launch pad 39A here at NASA's Kennedy Space Center in Florida. Her wings outstretched and ready to soar into space for the 39th and final time. Discovery's odometer reads 142,917,535 miles, or 100 miles, and Discovery is going to add about another 4.5 million miles to that total on this 11-day mission when it roars off the launch pad at 4.50 p.m. today and races to 17,500 miles an hour in about 8.5 minutes. Right after the launch tower is cleared today, Discovery will perform a roll maneuver which points it precisely on the proper 51.6 degree trajectory to catch up to the International Space Station, our target in orbit. At the time of liftoff, the space station will be about 220 miles above the South Pacific. And as the shuttle rockets to the northeast, it will climb and accelerate to 17,500 miles an hour to begin the chase. STS-133 is an 11-day mission to the space station. It will deliver the Permanent Multipurpose Module, or PMM, which was converted from the Leonardo Multipurpose Logistics Module to withstand the harsh elements of space. The PMM will provide additional storage for the station uh, and experiments that may also be conducted inside of it, such as fluid physics, material science, biology, and biotechnology. Discovery also will carry critical spare components to the station and the Express Logistics Carrier 4, or ELC-4, which is an external platform that holds large equipment to be transported using the unique capability of the shuttle. Also, Robonaut 2, or R2, will become the first human-like robot in space when it flies inside the PMM to become a permanent resident of the station. The STS-133 mission will feature two spacewalks conducted by Bowen and Drew to do maintenance work and install new components on the station. Here inside Launch Control Center, the countdown for Discovery's launch is continuing on schedule. The window opens at 4.45 p.m. today, and our preferred and planned launch time is five minutes later at 4.50 and 27 seconds p.m. Eastern Time. We're at T-minus three hours in holding. This is Shuttle Launch Control.